These are the Samyang Bulldog cheese flavor. Now I tried the one X spicy, two X spicy, and yes, they were painful, although I also think that they are very delicious. So keep in mind when I'm eating these things, I'm actually enjoying them. I'm not doing it just so that I can look very painful on video for you guys. According to my research, this cheese flavor is one of the top flavors of this Samyang Boldak brand. With that said, let me just say, I've added a little bit too much water previously, and also I forgot to stir fry it. So this time with that in mind, I'm gonna try to do it the most proper way as possible. Let's take a look at this package. I know a little bit more about this brand now. It turns out this chicken mascot, his name is called Hochi, and it has this smug face saying, oh, look at this cheese, it tastes so good. I would have to say this little mascot thing kind of pulled me towards this brand. It looks kind of cute. So you kind of want to eat this cheese flavor and it says hot chicken flavor ramen. So I assume it's going to be just as spicy as the one X. This you see here is a five pack. I see they got smart and copied the rest of the industry where they divide the ramen in half just to make the numbers look good. So then your sodium is 720 milligrams times two, 1440 milligrams. Wow, look, you get some calcium, a little bit of potassium and iron as well. Here are the ingredients, relatively few, as I said before, compared to other ramen brands where the list of ingredients is roughly twice as much. I would have to say after I eat this, I don't feel any ill effects other than the salt. Let me draw your attention to that. This is artificial cheese flavor powder and also artificial chicken flavor powder. So you're gonna eat a whole bunch of artificial ingredients over here. It's not real cheese. It's not real chicken. Here they are all laid out in its glory. Of course, I only wanna cook one of them. You have this cheese flavor packet, like a cheese powder that you add to it. And the hot sauce part where it has the cheese logo on it, it seems like this is specially formulated for this cheese flavor. The noodles itself look exactly the same as the other options. Six hundred milliliters of water. Well, this package has some new instructions with a little mascot on it. 600 ml of boiling water for five minutes. Eight spoons of water. I wish they tell you how big a spoon you're supposed to use. Stir fry for 30 seconds and then add the cheese sauce in. Cook this for five minutes. Two, one. Well, there it is. Filter out the water. This time I'm gonna add eight teaspoons. One, two, eight. If you remove the corner like this, it's a little bit cleaner. Now I'm gonna add the cheese flavor. Mixing it in. It smells very cheesy. Doesn't smell as spicy though. Okay, let's give this a shot. Is it gonna be very, very spicy? I don't know. Mmm, spicy. <laughs> it reminds me of macaroni and cheese. You know the mac and cheese, the Kraft mac and cheese stuff? Of course, no longer do you get the sesame seeds. I don't see as many or none at all. And there's a little bit of seaweed pieces in there. Tastes good. I'm thinking I'm gonna enjoy this. This tastes good. Cheese. 
Now, just from the first few bites, do I prefer this one or the 1x one or the 2x spicy? I would have to say 2x spicy. You kind of don't want to do that all the time, just kind of once in a while just to try it, unless your spice tolerance is really high. For just having it casually, I would want to eat the 1x for now. <clears throat> do I want 1x or the cheese flavor though? I think I have to finish this, wait like a day, and then kind of think about this first. Stir frying it really made things a little bit better because it's no longer kind of like liquid runny all over on the plate. See, everything is kind of adhered to the noodle, so you're eating everything. It's a little bit sweet. Okay, napkin. Mmm. <clears throat> Very spicy. Nose is running a little bit, so you know it's a little, it's not like, you gotta be able to take some spice if you're gonna eat this thing. Mmm. The noodles are bouncy. I don't know if you guys can see it, see? If I move it, it's like noing, noing, noing. I do enjoy the noodles. Kind of lap up all the, all the powder. Stir frying it helps with the, um, the slurping because last time when I slurped it, it's still kind of liquidy. So then it splatters a lot more. This is kind of more sticky. Maybe because of the cheese, but I think um, the stir frying really kind of evaporates a lot of the a lot of the soup. You guys are wondering. I did put on order a three x spicy uh, full deck. <laughs> it's coming in the mail. It turns out they don't sell it in the United States. I can't find it anywhere. Not in the supermarket. Not on Amazon. The only way I was obtaining it is um, on eBay. It turns out they do sell it in Australia, it seems. Yeah, I can finish this without feeling too much pain. Hmm. Like you gotta wanna feel like cheese. I don't always feel like cheese. Just, you know, sometimes you feel like having more cheese because it's kind of heavy feeling. Kind of thick. Hmm. I think it's because it's spicy that I like it. Now the real test is if I just kind of wait around. Is it gonna get increasingly spicy? Oh, yeah. Especially when I'm talking, I'm blowing all this hot air out. Oh. And yes, I'm drinking ice water. It does help cool it down, even though it's not milk. I think it just dilutes it. Ah, posing for the camera for the thumbnail. But man, it's really, it's getting, it increases in spiciness, just like the other ones after you stop eating. And yes, the water does help. Yeah, no problem. In terms of enjoyment, pretty good. It's like different flavors. Like you have the cheese flavor, you have the one X spicy. Sometimes you feel like cheese, you pick that one. I think you just gotta have those around and then, you know, whatever floats your boat on that day, then you pick it and eat that one. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It will take a while before I receive my 3X spicy package because it's coming in internationally. If you guys are interested in the 1X, 2X, or cheese flavor of this Bulldog Samyang brand ramen noodles, I'll leave a link for Amazon affiliate down in the video description below. Thanks for watching.